Now, South Sudan will officially become a sovereign nation July 9th, but with the excitement comes the challenge of rebuilding the country's institutions. The president, Salva Kiir, accused the vice president, Reid Machar, of an attempted coup. Des combats ont éclaté aujourd'hui entre les partisans de Salva Kiir et ceux de Reid Machar, ne suscitant d'anciennes dissensions entre les différents clans de la rébellion qui ont conduit le pays à l'indépendance. Violence is raging in the world's newest country. Hundreds are feared dead in Juba, the capital of South Sudan. Many have fled the city, others are hunkering down trying to stay safe. Haja Sanbamu, Yel Utanade, and do Lisa Haja Umbeg de Ramu, like in Mavis Mosada. The Namasha, the Guru Tamelekia. And Manatina Zato Mato. I told Mavis and Mato. Anamara, Anna didn't get up with that. Some children were killed, some women were killed, some police were killed. It's like tick for tag. You read tomorrow, I'll come and read tomorrow. You read tomorrow, I'll come and read tomorrow. <laughs> They have a great enmity. So and so killed my husband. So and so killed my brother. So and so killed my children. That means they will have these grudges and they will do revenge killing. If such kind of issues are not solved, it will be continuous. People will still continue to have bitterness in their hearts. So if we solve the issue of cattle raiding and educate the cattle keepers, they can share the resources, the available resources together, and there will be development. South Sudan will develop. It's time to hold the pen, but not the guns. It's, it's, it's a long run.
I joined WPDI in 2014. I was selected by the community to represent the people and speak. So I believe maybe I have some abilities that I can move people, I can do something positive in them. So it was not out of my own will, but I feel it is something that is in me. Asan, kedi na build the base. 